In this snip, we'll see how to create a new Office 365 tenant. And for the purpose of this demonstration, we will choose an Office 365 plan E3. So once you're on the Office 365 page, you have the option to buy now if you wish to do so, or you can also click on free trial and that will give you a 30 day trial of the product. Now it's time to create our tenant. You need to choose your country carefully because you cannot change it after. Then we need to enter our first name and last name, a business email address, a business phone number, your company name, and the size of your organization for information. Once we've done this, we can click on next. Now it's time to create our first user. Choose a username then choose a tenant name. And if this tenant name is already taken, then as soon as you click away, you'll see that this is not available. So we need to choose another one. Click away. This one is available. So we need to create a password. Confirm your password. Then you can set your preferences if you want Microsoft to contact you. And click on create my account. We need to prove that we are not a robot. So you need to enter a valid phone number and choose whether you want to receive a text or a call with the Microsoft code that you will need to enter on the next page. I'm going to leave this as a text and click on text me. Now I'm going to enter the code that I received on my phone and click on next. When we are finished, we can click on start setup. Straight away, you have two options available. You can install your Office apps or you can set up your email, OneDrive and Skype for business. But if you don't want to set up anything at this point in time, you can navigate to the app launcher and click on the admin tile. If you are not familiar with Office 365, you have the possibility to start a tour or you can simply click on skip. And we have now created our Office 365 tenant. Thanks for watching.